Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about what questions you should ask a realtor when you're thinking about selling your house. I'm Spencer Schumacher. I'm Spencer Real Estate Group. I work out of Madison, Wisconsin. I uh, work in the greater surrounding areas. Uh, but I want to focus today on what questions you should ask uh, a realtor when you're interviewing and to see if you should, uh, if you want them to list your house, your biggest asset you have out there, right? You have to make sure this person knows what they're doing. So I got six questions for you. First of all, how long have they been an agent? And are they a full-time agent? Okay, I'm going to combine that into one. Uh, experience means something. There's a lot of people who can get into this business very quickly, and it's easy to stumble upon themselves and to not know what they don't know at that point. So, full-time agent, and uh, how long have they been in the business? What areas do you specialize in? Do you sell houses anywhere in this area? Uh, if someone asks me if I could help them uh, sell a house in Milwaukee, I'm going to tell them no. Milwaukee is out of my area. Now, I, I work in. Dane County and our surrounding counties, it's greater Madison area. If we go to Milwaukee, I'm going to be in the wrong, uh, the wrong area that I don't know what I'm getting myself into. So where do you work? Uh, what areas do you work in? How will you market my property? Many agents are just going to put the house in the MLS and pray that it sells. Okay. There is a strategy out there for marketing to try to get the most viewers on your listing, the most, the best pictures, the best marketing is going to win the day. You get the most for your dollar. Uh, you're going to get the most return on your investment above list price or below list price, whatever the market currently is, but you're going to get the most for your dollar if it's marketed properly. When you speak about marketing, one of the things you should talk about is this uh, pricing strategy. Obviously we have to agree upon what price to list the house for, but what is that strategy going to look like? Are we going to shoot for the moon? Are we going to shoot a little lower? Are we going to try to get 50 offers and let them negotiate it out? There are different pricing uh, ways to price a, a property. Um, will you communicate with me throughout the selling process? It's very important. One of the things that is most frustrating for sellers is when you don't actually hear from the agent. So tell me how you're going to communicate, when you're going to communicate, and so I understand what to expect. Setting expectations is huge. And besides the basics of listing house, what kind of staging suggestions are you going to have for me? Do you have a stager who's going to come in for me? Do you have someone who's going to help me understand what I need to do to, to maximize the return on my house? Whether it's uh, repairs, uh, it could be some moving items, getting stuff out, storing stuff. So there's a lot of different questions there. So six things to remember when you're selling a house. Uh, please reach out if you have questions. I would love to cover them in detail with you.